So, hello everyone. Great to be here. We love Duck TV in Nijmegen. We love it so much that we made Hannes a full professor. <laughs> Congratulations, Hannes. <laughs> so, I do research on information retrieval. And information retrieval, are pretty, people are pretty uh, obnoxious. They don't believe that databases have anything to offer. And I spent already my whole career in trying to convince people it might be different. Um, I'm still convincing people, so it's not been that successful so far. But we have new hope to make this successful. So why do you want it? Well, we rank text in many more occasions, and we saw that in the Hockey Face talk. Um, even if you do just IR experiments like me and my students, well, they become more and more complex because of all sorts of data types that also need to be handled and they're hard to put in an inverted file, let alone in a FICE index. Um, and there's something that I call the Wikipedia problem, and that's because a lot of information retrieval uses Wikipedia to perform well in accuracy. But then Wikipedia always means Wikipedia 2014, typically, because somebody who wrote the code downloaded it in 2014. Maybe it becomes Wikipedia 2019, but it's never Wikipedia, right? So we need better support for data management in IR. Few examples. We saw this one today already uh, in the Hacking Face talk. Thanks for saving me time. I always say one slide per minute, and I'm breaking the rule. Um, we run a European uh, Horizon Europe project called Open Web Search, and the goal is to undermine Google and all these big tech companies by creating our own web index that everybody can share. And the creation of index, the inversion is what is expensive. Now, we will do the inversion on the supercomputers from CERN and SURF and all sorts of data centers in Europe. Uh, and, and they committed to do that. So what comes out is, uh, at the moment, SIF files, which sort of contain the whole index in protobuf. Um, and parquet files with the metadata about what language is this page in. Do we believe that this is a safe page? Okay. So these data are large, large-ish. Uh, DuckDB already helps here on the supercomputer computers to do the partitioning of the parquet files and align it with the partitioning of the SIF files, uh, except for one little discussion that we hope to get support for. Um, ongoing work. Um, I've been spending some time only the last two weeks, and it was very smooth to turn this protobuf via parquet into DuckDB tables that would be accessible from the FTS extension. And this sort of works. It's almost done. I also discovered, okay, uh, there is some transformation needed, and I do that in Python now. But actually, this windowing queries, they are awesome. So might move even more to SQL. The big question I have is, why is it not using automatically P for Delta for inverted file posting list? That's strange. So I don't understand it yet. Um, we also built a graph database on DuckDB that is very experimental and not really useful in practice. But it will let you use queries like this, where you can say, okay, which pairs of documents have a co-author and are about the topic. And that would otherwise look like this and much more error prone to write. Um, the last thing, similarity search in high dimensions. Uh, it's very popular now. People talk about something called vector databases. Well, here's my take on vector databases. These vector databases will all be swallowed by general purpose databases, especially DuckDB. Um, it's unclear if the data model will be relational again, but I suspect that it has a high chance. Okay, the real solution that I want to work on but haven't found a student capable of and time for myself yet is to revive an old paper called Bond. Read it, you might like it. But the quicker solution, thanks to starting work from uh, uh, Hannes and then a student who's following up on it, is to uh, run FICE along DuckDB 
And what's interesting, if you have filter like all the documents like this that are in English, then the results of the filter can be pure DuckDB and transported. And then the HNSW search in FICE is restricted by that. And this all works pretty well with the interoperability between FICE and uh, the ID selector or bitmap uh, things uh, from uh, that, that FICE has. I think they're strict, so I need to wrap up. Last advertorial. This was a paper last year, and it's actually a paper with code, and all the code is sort of a DuckTB. Thank nice. you.